جنگی Good evening and welcome to NBC News at 6. I am your host, Alice K. Jones, and joining me a little later is going to be the beautiful co-host, Jamila Jones. I'm sure everyone probably already heard about this big spectacular month coming up for New Elk Creek Baptist Church. Starting on July the 21st, and let me say that again, July the 21st, we are going to have a homecoming celebration. So everyone that's a part of the creek, everyone that's not a part of the creek, come on back home and you'll feel welcome. Next after that, we're going to have a No Limit Revival. So but before we go any further, let's have a few words from our sponsors. Sponsors? Polly's and Lady D's Beauty Salon. Featuring twine of virtuous images. news. I hear that we have a live correspondent by Brian Umbel who's live in the field at New Dove Creek Baptist Church and he has some exclusive interviews. So take it away Brian. Brian? Once again, we're live on the doorsteps of New Dove Creek Baptist Church. We have with us Mr. Chad Freeman, a faithful member of the Creek. Mr. Freeman, tell me, what do you love about this church, New Dove Creek? Hey, the Creek is just the place to be. You got great ministers like Brian Omer, his wife Felicia, First Lady and Pastor, they always crock in the pulpit. If you're young and you like the two-step, you can come see First Lady do that every Sunday. Um, just a lot of stuff going on, activities for the kids. Come, come on out and join us and have a good time. So I take it that you are excited about 2013 homecoming. Always, I love everything that go on at the creek. There you have it. And we have with us right now the Brown family, Shamia and Anthony Brown. They have some great things they want to say about this church, homecoming and revival. And uh, Miss Brown, I ask you, what do you love so much about New Dove Creek Baptist Church? I love because it's a place where I can come and learn more about God and feel love and just grow in God. Now, Mr. Brown. Are you excited about homecoming and revival this year? Yes, I am very excited. Matter of fact, I want to invite everyone to come out to our homecoming. I want y'all to come relax, feel the joy, feel the love. Come as you are, and you're welcome. Once again, we're live on the doorsteps of New Dove Creek Baptist Church. We have uh, one of the faithful members of New Dove Creek, Sturgeon Newman. Uh, Mr. Newman, tell me, what do you love so much about New Dove Creek? Um, the family environment. On the first day you step foot in the door, we treat you like family. Um, the the um, ushers, they go out of their way to make sure you're comfortable. And it's just, we know, they know the minister, the minister knows you by name. It's just a family life. It's a great place to come serve and worship God. So uh, I can assume that you're excited about homecoming and revival this year? Oh yeah, most definitely. Um, homecoming is always best to come to come in. And we may not have seen it for a while. And while we all have great, um, great people, and um, Ray Jordan comes in, he brings a powerful word, and he truly gives a blessing to everybody else. So I'm excited. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you, Mr. Newman. Thank you. We're guys? live on the doorsteps of New Dell Creek Baptist Church. We have one of our youngest members, youngest members of, of Young Society, Miss hey, Lexi. Miss Lexi, um, tell me. Do you love New Dell Creek Baptist Church? Yeah. Well, why, how, why do you love New Dell Creek Baptist Church? I like to sing. Oh, you like to sing. So that, that tells me you're excited about homecoming? Yeah. You coming to homecoming? Yeah. And you coming to revival? Yeah. Every night? Yeah. From the mouth of babes. Great job, Brian. Now, joining me now in the NBC studios, we have my lovely co-host, Jamila Jones. Jamila, can you tell us a little bit about what's happening now? Jamila? Absolutely right. New Love Creek is proud to 
announced the 2013 homecoming with the very dynamic Apostle Shakita Clark of Restoration Anointed Worship of Livonia, Georgia. What's a homecoming without a revival? We are looking forward to another powerful word from God this year, revival as we bring Apostle A.J. Richardson for three consecutive years. Alice, this is one event you don't want to miss. That's right, Jamila. I've had my appointment at Torrance to get my hair finger away for about a month now. I'm not giving it up for anyone. <laughs> but it's time to pay the bills. Let's hear another word from our sponsors. You know, this our uh, church anniversary. And you know they going to be feet at the church on that day Sunday. And you know, uh, they asked me to make the tater salad this year. Some of the women get mad at my tater salad because, you know, I really think they, 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 they think it tastes better. But they don't really want to uh, accept the fact that my tater salad is the best. And, we, you know, with that being said, you know, that's why I use gas it. That the way I, it just, it just make everything just float. It's the gas just expert. Yeah, it's gas X. Thanks for tuning back in. We have Brian on the scene live with more interviews. Brian, can you hear me? We're live on the doorstep of New Dog Creek Baptist Church where we're here with uh, one of our faithful members, Miss LaVon Allen. Miss Allen. Tell us, what do you love so much about the creek? The creek goes back a long way for me. Uh, it's my home church, my family, my grandfather, and, and beyond that. And we've had a lot of good years here. I remember the old church. And it's just a beautiful, loving place. And in, today, in today's world, I see it as a place of growth. I see a pastor who is prophetic and his lovely wife. I see youth. And as long as you have youth, you have a church. And I just love everybody here. And it's, it's home. So I can assume that you're excited about homecoming 2013. Always. Homecoming is just what it says. Homecoming. Where you come to see people you haven't seen in a long time. You come out for fellowship, food, and lots of love and praise. We have with us Mr. Jermaine Willingham, a member of New Dove Creek Baptist Church. Mr. Willingham, I ask you, are you excited about 2013 homecoming here at the Creek? Excited as I can be. Now, tell us, if you have any family and friends that haven't decided on whether or not they're going to join us, what would you say to them? You don't know what you miss. Thank you, Mr. Willingham. We have with us Miss Katie Holman. Uh, Miss Katie, I'm asking you, uh, how, what do you, how do you feel about New Dove Creek Baptist Church? I love New Dove Creek. I love coming. I love the, when I do come, I love the praise, I love the worship, and I love the pastor, what he's preaching, everything, everything I love about New Dog Tree. I love to get up in the morning time when I don't have to go to work. I come and I enjoy every minute of it. So you're excited about 2013's No Limit, No Boundaries um, a homecoming this year, correct? Yes, I am. So you're going to make it to Revival? I'm praying I do. Every night? I'm praying I do. <laughs> <laughs> so there you have it. Thank you, Miss Katie. We're going back to you, Alice and Jamila. We're here with Minister Corey Thornton, who is the visionary of this year's theme. Uh, Mr. Corey, could you explain more? Yes, our vision for 2013 Homecoming Revival is no limits, no boundaries, shifting higher, higher in Jesus Christ. Now, as I look and I was praying about the theme, God showed me that there was a lot of Christians, there's a lot of believers that are living beneath their means when it comes to the Word of God. And God has so, many, so much more out there for us to go do and go get. So God has called us to the nation, and we cannot be called to the nation just stuck in one area. So no limits, no boundaries when it comes to God's Word. It's time for the Christian to go out there, explore more, get more, do more for what God has called us to do in this season. Thank you, Mr. Corey. And this concludes our segment. Back to you, Alice and Jamila. Signing off. Thank you, Brian. Guess what, Alice?
guys, we have a new weather girl. Woo woo! In the NDC Weather Center with your forecast. Hi, Latoya. Thank you, Jamila. I'm Latoya, and I'm here with the weather forecast here at the Creek. For those of you that have sown your seat faithfully, I see an abundance of rain. Continue to be blessed as we all transition into Jesus' name. Back to you, Alex and Jamila. Wow, that was a great job, Latoya. Jamila, how many weather girls how do we have? Oh, huh. I'm sorry. The producers are coming through, say we need a commercial break. We'll see you back after this break. Thank you. Cam McClary, I'm the pastor of New York Creek Baptist Church. And I'm with Sheikah McClary, co-pastor of New Dove Creek Baptist Church. Are you feeling overwhelmed, experiencing hardship, oppression, or sickness in your body? Are you tired of watching others prosper while you lag behind? Do you believe you're on the brink of a breakthrough and need more? We invite you to join us for a worship experience that will inspire you to apply the Word of God, believing Him for a better life. We meet Sundays for Sunday School at 10 a.m., followed by worship service at 11.15 a.m. Fourth Sundays, we meet at 9 a.m. for early worship, followed by 11.15 worship service. And join us on Wednesdays for Bible study at 7 o'clock p.m. We look forward to having you and we pray peace, joy, and prosperity on your behalf as you transition in Jesus. Once again, we would like to take this opportunity to invite everyone to our 2013 homecoming and our No Limit, No Boundaries revival. At this time, we would also like to welcome Restoration Anointed Worship Center to our home. On behalf of Apostle and Pastor McClary, we wish above all things that you may prosper and be in health, even as your soul prosper as we all transition in Jesus. Thank you for tuning in, and God bless. <laughs>